Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create realistic highlighters, highlighter. And by the name is, my name is Nadia. So I'm going to give you a link and you will need to download these two files. Download. And after we download, I'm going to open them. Okay, we have them. Okay, next thing, we're going to start new project, blank project. And I like to add face mesh. So when we create face mesh, face tracker appears automatically. And let's do smoothing first. And let's add material for smoothing. make it retouch 27 good and full screen I don't I like to uncheck okay so now we are doing our highlighters add face mesh you see it's under smoothing I don't want that I want it to be like under face tracker so I'm gonna click I move it under the face tracker and then let's call it highlighter highlighter And add material, create new material, highlighter, okay. And now that's the folder that we downloaded. So now I'm gonna drag to assets to my panel. Okay, so this is going to be physically based. Texture, we're going to choose highlighter. Going to switch to my video. And then I'm going to put 100, 100 for metallic. And for roughness, it's going to be 60. And I'm going to keep this as, as zero. Now I'm going to normal. Normal, I click here, like this uh, blue thing. And I'm choosing. And I'm choosing Nadia Moore map. I'm going down and I'm choosing blending mode. It's going to be screen. And the opacity going to be... 20 level side mode you don't see anything now but don't worry and for the co color I will pick uh, yellow and the numbers of the color is going to do 5 3 2 0 4 5 3 and 1 0 7 so it's this type of yellow okay so we are done with this part and also let me see oh sorry about that render options yeah we click double-sided okay so now i'm add, adding lights it's going to be directional light insert and for that directional light we're going to keep the position as it is but we're going to change the rotation and for rotation is going to be 90 uh, no not minus just 90.2 for the x for the y it's going to be minus 61.1 and for the z it's going to be 86.4 good and let's add one more light. Actually, let's not add, let's duplicate this one. When we duplicate, it saves the, it saves the settings. So now we're going to rotation. And then for the Y, we take away the minus. And for the Z, we are adding the minus. Okay. 
Look, our highlighter is working now. And let me check on this curl. Looks good, right? Or for example, on this guy. Well, I think we need to maybe increase opacity a little bit more. So let's go back to highlighter and make opacity like 25. You can play with the opacity so they're more visible. Okay, thank you so much, guys. If you like this lesson, please subscribe and also check out my Instagram because I have lots of different masks. And thank you so much. Have a good day.